NASA's highly anticipated experimental jet, the X-59, has successfully completed its first taxi test under its own power, marking a major advancement in the agency's mission to redefine supersonic travel. The milestone event took place on July 10, 2025, at U.S. Air Force Plant 42 in Palmdale, California. The test involved rolling the X-59 across the runway at low speeds, allowing engineers and pilots to evaluate the aircraft's braking system, steering mechanisms, and overall ground handling. For the first time since its assembly, the X-59 moved independently without the aid of external towing vehicles, a key sign of readiness for flight. NASA test pilot Nils Larsen, who was at the controls during the test, praised the achievement, noting that it signifies real progress toward eventual flight trials. We've now reached the phase where the aircraft is beginning to act like an airplane, not just a prototype sitting in a hangar, he said. This ground test is the first in a series of incremental trials designed to gradually prepare the aircraft for its maiden flight. Over the coming weeks, the X-59 will conduct increasingly faster taxi runs. These high-speed trials will push the aircraft just shy of liftoff, ensuring that all onboard systems, ranging from avionics to control surfaces, perform reliably under more demanding conditions. The X-59 is the centerpiece of NASA's Quest mission, Quiet Supersonic Technology, a research initiative focused on developing aircraft that can fly faster than sound without causing disruptive sonic booms. Traditional supersonic planes produce loud, thunderous booms that have long restricted overland travel at such speeds. The X-59, however, is designed to generate only a subtle, sonic, thump that is far less intrusive. Shaped with a slender fuselage, long nose, and uniquely engineered airframe, the X-59 aims to minimize shockwaves that typically result in a boom when breaking the sound barrier. If successful, this innovation could lead to a paradigm shift in how regulators approach supersonic travel over land. NASA plans to use data collected during the X-59 test program to inform both U.S. and international aviation authorities. The goal is to influence the development of new regulations that would eventually allow commercial supersonic aircraft to operate over populated areas, something currently prohibited due to noise concerns. The implications of the X-59 project go far beyond this single aircraft. Should the Quest mission achieve its objectives, it could pave the way for a new generation of quieter, faster commercial airliners, drastically reducing travel time while maintaining community comfort. In essence, the X-59 isn't just another experimental aircraft, it's a glimpse into the future of air travel, where speed and silence may finally coexist. Thank you.